the other video just stopped again because I went over. Hi, Sonia. Okay. I was sharing these, another one of those studs. These are $1.49. I feel it should have been $0.99, cents, right? But go find them somewhere else. The price is awesome. Okay. Now I found washi tape, little bees. Look at that one, how pretty. Got that one. I got the one with the hearts. This one says love. So cute. And you can't beat that price. 99 cents. Because you go somewhere else and they're um, $3.99. AC Moore has them for $3.99. Oh, I got another one of these little metal thingies. This one was 99 cents. And I like the little spoon, fork, and knife. And then here's some of these. This reminds me of, and actually it says Napoleon, too. Like that Napoleon ice cream that comes chocolate, strawberry, and vanilla. And it just made me want to have some, too. If it wasn't raining, I'd go to Dairy Queens. How pretty is this one? Look at the foil on there. Nice. And then this one, I couldn't make out what it was. And I swear I said it might be ghost or just um, trees. But then over here, it tells you it's coral reefs. So if I'd have looked at that, I'd have saved myself a couple of minutes. Um, this one says Christmas, and it's like a little... Do I have it the wrong way? A train. Look at that, how cute. It says Christmas. And then there's... This one I picked up two of these, and that was a mistake. That wasn't supposed to happen, but that's okay. Uh, this one is apples. Got that one. And this one's so cute. Look at that. And there's this one as well. And... This is what started it all. I saw this and it's so adorable. And all of these were 99 cents. Look at that one. This one is um, school something. What does it say? Oh, doodle. <laughs> it doesn't say school shit. It wasn't nothing. Sorry. <laughs> I don't believe I just said that. But I, anyway, it has all that applies to the school. But it's doodling, guys. Doodling. So that is it for my... Um, washi tape like that wasn't enough right <laughs> so I'm gonna just stick these all in here only because I have to go through my receipt and make sure that um, I was charged properly because I had so much stuff and I paid like for my stuff separately and the stuff I picked up from my girlfriend so I want to make sure that I didn't pay attention to the scanning. I want to make sure everything is it is what it is, right? Go some more, and I like this thingy. This is not. This is the white one. So this one will cover the background. I bet white. I'm pretty sure it will. Acrylic soft gel paint, solid coverage. Yeah. Create background or paint designs for paper, crafting journals, and mixed media. Dries to a velvety smooth satin finish so I can leave these out I don't have to put these back in the bag but I am going to keep these guys together so they got these from the dollar store I have quite a few of them laying around but I use these a lot when I'm going to group my stuff so that I can find them so this is what I use from the dollar tree where is the other one? You see what I'm saying? I already misplaced one. And the other one was right here. So I keep them together. And usually right behind me is where I just stick everything. Okay. So that is what I've done so far, guys. And again, Jackie, thank you. Thank you so much, honey, for picking up those items for me. And, um... Yeah. Okay, this is that paint. Oh, wow. I like that. It dried. Look how nice. It's still like a little moist, but it's okay. And then here, I could still see the background of the paint. It kind of makes it, yeah, it's pretty nice. But it kind of consumed the paint, though. I wonder if it would do the same thing with the Ranger ink. 
if I were to stamp something. I like it because I, you can stamp anything and then just, even though you could still do it anything else, but you guys know what I mean. Right? Yeah, right. Okay, I was going to share with you guys. Um, again, I don't know if I did in my other video because esta vieja está loca. Um, I had picked this up a Tuesday morning before I left to Puerto Rico. I don't know, but anyway. It's called Color and Creation. Color it once, enjoy it forever. So that's what it looks like. And see that? All three of these. And I colored this one. Now, I was going to put them out today to um, spray them down to seal the color in. But it's raining. So what I'm going to do is just finish painting the other ones. And... Um, yeah, and then I can take them outside because I have some jars that I need to finish up painting. I got to catch up to my life. Ay, Dios mío. Yeah, so. And then, did I ever share these guys? These are the ones I picked up from Puerto Rico, that famous store called Capri. So if you're ever in Puerto Rico, guys, go shopping at this store. These were $5, and that's what that stamp looks like. So I have the boy and the girl. So I thought these were cute. I picked those up. And then, remember the metal piece I said I had to um, start and finish it? I sat here and I finally did it, guys. I sat here. I used um, this little, where this one here. Look at my, I, I didn't like glue it down. I just left it kind of dangling. I did glue it to this here. And then I put that little wood bird there. And these flowers here, these are Prima flowers, but this here is from um, Jolie's Boutique. Uh, what is that called? Cherry Blossoms, I think it is. And I put one on her hair. This is all Prima stuff. And I use that new um, Prima paint that I just bought the other day, and I'll put them all over there. It's kebab. But uh, the uh, Alchemy Art, yeah. And... What is the, I can't remember the colors, but I do know that um, the gold one in here, it's called Dragon Eyes. And then all the Prima flowers I use there. This is that new Prima doll stamp. I don't know her name. Uh, don't know her name, guys, but yeah, she's in there somewhere. So that's my final thingy with this. And actually, you know what? I did put like a little bit of glue so that it can pop up and stay popped up, but it didn't happen. I put some rhinestones in there. You see that? I just love how she came out. And I use coloring her. I use my Copics, which I meant to try um, my, um, what's that all the ones? My chameleons. I haven't played with them yet. So, yeah, I did that. And then I took my other one and see, I don't, you see, that's what happens. I moved before. Um, I know where my stuff is at, but now I don't know where nothing's at because I move stuff around. I did, with the other ones that I had done on the canvas, I also use um, that Prima Al Alchemy paint. Ay, Dios mío. Anyway, I don't know where it's at. But I did that one as well. You see what I'm saying? I do my stuff and I lose it. I use it or lose it. And if I use it, I still lose it. Okay, so that is it, guys, for now. Uh, stay tuned. I will be sharing some more stuff in the near future. Bye for now. And thank you all for watching, and you'll have a great evening. Enjoy the rest of the week. Be safe, and happy crafting. Bye for now.